And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we've got Champions League group stage action to look forward to. It is Victoria Pilsen facing Real Madrid. Well, the players love these games, Derek. It's a break from league football, just gives you a little bit of a rest. But you have to focus on different types of players, players you're not used to playing against every week. Do your research, who you're marking, who you're playing against. Derek, 4-2-3-1 really, two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. Well, they are the record winners of this great competition, Real Madrid, and you always feel, Lee, that no matter the stage of the competition, where Real Madrid are concerned, you're witnessing history. Well, absolutely. Their history would suggest that they need to win every game because the pressure is always on them, and quite rightly so. And very, very close to my heart because they came over in 99 and played in my testimonial, so I love Real Madrid. Very generous of them. They chose well. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois, the Belgian, will be in goal. Sergio Ramos plays with Rafael Varane at the back. And leading the attack today is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Kolas. Tuchela. Ramos completely on top of the situation. Marco Asensio defeated through. Turning inside, where's he going to go? Mbappe! He's going to be angry with himself, Lee, having failed to take that chance so early in the game. Well, the first chance of a game is important, but the first goal, sometimes it comes, you're not expecting it. Give it away. Well, a strong case, Lee, can be made for Marco Asensio as a potential match winner here. Well, yeah, Brace in his last game will certainly be a threat. Can he get another two goals or even three in this game? He had the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. He just needs to stay level-headed now. And finishing, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Well, here we can see, Derek, from this better angle, it's all about the technique. When you're volleying a ball, it's all about timing. Let it get to the right place for your foot to make the connection. And there you go, in the back of the net. So, underway again with Real Madrid in front. Forjava. Roman Prohaska. Trzela. Kermencic. Marco Asensio. Is it going to be? And that is offside. This is Varan. Here's Carvajal. Isco has it. Marcelo. Isco. Marco has and fed forwards. Still alive. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. 
He's given us away. The ball with Luka Modric. I must say, no shortage of space. Now he must favour the cross. Mbappe. And Marco Asensio. The ball with Luka Modric. Isco. Carvajal. The cross from Danny Carvajal. And on the ball, Horjava. Given away. Excellent challenge. The referee knew that was fun. I think he knew he was guilty of fouling. Free kick conceded. Here is Marco Asensio. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. Trying his luck from long range. And it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Marcelo. And Isco. Can he make this move count? Cutting in, what can he do from this position? He scores! Kovaci. Now Daniel Kolas. Can they do something? Can they cut open the defence with a through ball? Pushed into the penalty area. Decent cross, but nobody in the vicinity. And Scott for the cross. Accurate ball and draws the near post. No spillage from the goalkeeper. Routine. Real Madrid have given it away. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. That is that for the first half here. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very... So, ready for the start of the second half, and Real Madrid currently in front. Aubameyang and now Aubameyang going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss and on the ball Borjava running with the ball confidently electing to cross into the centre well, he had a decent reading of that ball in Carvajal Pierre Emerick Aubameyang's well timed pass here speculative ball fired to the near post and the goal it is for Real Madrid they are on a victory course Well, the keeper will be frustrated. He thought he'd saved it. He's so unlucky there. It's a good angle from him as well, but it's in the back of the net. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. So, 2-0 now. Porjava. Patrick Froshovsky. David Limbersky. Will there be a tangible end product? And
30 minutes left for play in this match. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Marco Asensio defeat it through. Opportunity it is. Still possibilities. Cutting the ball back. And in it goes! Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. People can do anything about it. to scoring goals like this. Now with Obadiyan. And Kovacic here with it. Kermencic. And on the ball, Haida. Marco Asensio. Now with Obadiyan. And it's with Petrojela. Throw ins given. Substitution for Real Madrid. given away might it be a bad day well Henry finishes dream the goal scored by Kylian Mbappe well as a finisher you have to be almost cold blooded and it's certainly applied to him on that occasion well here it is how do you like it in an open goal please no goalkeeper no defenders where were they all? There has been a gulf in quality tonight. We've really got to give them credit for the fact that they haven't let up at all. Kolas. It's been a thoroughly cogent and convincing performance in this match, Lee. Well, for him. Well, fortune didn't favour him. Off the post and out of play. Well, he's really unlucky. It was worth an effort, that's for sure. He's given it away. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Kamenchik has it. And a significant block. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. And a substitution in the offing. Delivered into the box. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Room to roam for the Merengues here. And on the ball, Haida. And it's a case of just five minutes left. Trzela. Now Daniel Kolarz. And a strong tackle. The ball with Luka Modric. Mbappe with it. And threaded through by Mbappe. And it's Aubameyang. And the Stein gets in. Well, here's the replay. You've got to ask questions about the back line and the goalkeeper. They're simply not there. On the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Given away. And there, the 
the story ends tonight. Three points for Real Madrid. Well, when you're assessing the game afterwards, there's little boxes to be ticked, and they ticked nearly all of them tonight. The defence, the goalkeeper, the midfield, the forwards look sharp. Really, really easy victory for them tonight. Clinical in front of goal. The manager, the coaches, the players, and the fans are all happy tonight.